Hi. So one of the things I hate about working with Wiremod in Gary's Mod is the fact that, well, it's not very complicated, but it takes a shit ton of time because you constantly have to switch between different tools. Like you need gates and then you need ranges and whatever, right? And especially gates takes a long time because not only do you need to find the gates tool, you also then have to search for the gate you need, select it. Oops, whoops. The fuck? Select it and spawn it and then search for another gate you need and then select it and spawn it, etc. And it's just very cumbersome, very uh, uncomfortable, etc. So I decided to make a tool that makes this a whole lot easier and a whole lot more comfortable. So I can now do all these all these things with my voice. Now it's still a work in progress and now there's still a lot of features and things I need to or want to fix. Um, spawn cactus. Spawn cactus. Spawn black, uh, spawn black king. Spawn black king. Spawn black queen. Spawn black queen. Spawn white queen and white king. Spawn white queen and white king. Right. Spawn metal plate two by two. Spawn metal plate two x two. And then of course I can also do things like switch tool, switch to the stacker. Switch to the stacker. Switch to screen. Switch to screen. Select constant value. Select constant value. So another thing I wanted to do was to make it easier to quick select some of these settings on some of these tools, like the value on the constant value. So I can also say, select constant value three. Select constant value three. Select constant value nine. Select constant value nine. All right, so this makes it a lot easier. And the same goes for, for for example, the uh, the wire tool. So I'm going to try to build a quick bomb here just to show you how easy it is. Um, Spawn ball. <laughs> All right. Select screen. Select screen. Select constant value nine. Select constant value Select nine. Select accumulator gate. Select accumulator gate. Select subtract gate. Select subtract Select gate. Select seal round up gate. Select ceiling Select less round up or gate. Equal to gate. Select less or equal gate. Select wire button. Select wire button. Select not invert gate. Select not invert gate. Um, Select explosive. Select explosive. For fuck's sake. So this is. Uh, an I don't think it's always been like this, but every time, like if you hold down Alt, you can see on the on the gun, on the screen, on the gun, it says no collide all, and it changes. So it's the same button as the walk button. So I always walk because I don't want to be running past my props while placing and stuff. And that means that every time I walk into it, it just falls off. It's really annoying, but it is what it is. Select remover. Select remover. Select wire button. Select wire button. Select thin red wire. Select thin red wire. Select yellow wire. Select yellow wire. Select very thin magenta wire. Select very thin magenta wire. Select white wire. Select wire wire. Select white wire. Select the light. <laughs> Select the white wire. Select the light. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Select the white cable. Select the white cable. Thank you. Um, Select select a very thick red wire. Select a very thick red wire. I think that's it. All right, so, I mean, at least it's a lot easier for me, so makes it a lot more fun to make these things because I don't constantly just want to quit because it's just so cumbersome. So, um, yeah. Anyways, thank you for watching.